Scratching that m and for a birthday party. There are 3,638 M&Ms in a classroom. There are 34 students in a classroom. In a class. All the students got M&Ms. How many M&Ms does each student get? I know that this is division, because it says how many M&Ms does each student get, which means division. I know the equation is 34 divided by 3,638, because it says there are 3,638 M&Ms in a classroom. There are 34 students in a, a classroom, and it says here all the students got M&Ms, which means that each student, each student got M&Ms, M&Ms. I know that this is a sharing problem. I know that this is a sharing problem because let's say that the M&Ms are in a bowl and that there are 3,638 M&Ms in the bowl. And it says that there are stu 34 students. Let's just say, I don't, I can't write all 34 students, but let's just say it's three, those three, then it would be each student would do it. It's asking how many, what's the value of one, of a group, of each group? How much would, how many M&Ms do each student get? And that's the question, how many, how many M&Ms do each student get? And that's kind of like sharing. Sharing is value of a group. And sharing is about like how many, it tells you, the group, the grouping, how many groups you have, and how many of it you have. And, but it doesn't tell you the value of each group. And I think that each group is kind of like a student, and the M&Ms are kind of the value. And the 3,638 are the amount that you have. So this is sharing because sharing is what the value of a group is and that's what this is asking. To solve this equation I did 34 times 100 which equal 3,400. That was a little low so I tried 34 times 110 which is 3,700. 3, 740, which is over 3,638. So I tried 34 times 105, which equaled 3,570. Now I was under, so I subtracted 3,570 by 3,638. Five, one, six, zero, zero. I know that 34 times 2 equals 68. 68, zero, zero. And 2, 105, 105 plus 2 equals 107. 107 M&Ms. Each student got each student got 107 M&Ms.